Hey there. Uh, those of you that use ScreenFlow, I know that you're probably really happy with it. It's an excellent program for recording uh, screencast on your Mac. But the video preview window or the the pre the eyesight window leaves a, a lot to be desired. It's kind of boring. So I found a way to make that eyesight window a little bit more interesting using a program called Cam Twist. If you look down here and you open up Cam Twist, you've got this box of selections. So in here, you have all these different effects. I have one selected here called Apple Broadcasting. And I've got my webcam selected. If you have more than one webcam, there would be a bunch of choices here. I have a rotating apple that you see over here in the bottom of the screen. You can scale that up to different a different size. You can move it around. So if I wanted to if I wanted to put it up here in the top of the screen, I could. You can put your um you can put your your name or, or any text that you want scrolling across the bottom and you can move where that text is on the screen so for example if I wanted to do that and then I wanted to put it in letterbox format I could so then I could go back and I could tweak it and and move the the Apple effect right there and then I could go back to my scrolling name and I could move that so that that's there. I mean, you can you can make it go faster or, or slower. You know, there, there are a lot of features in here and there are a lot of things you can do to jazz up this window. Uh, you know, you can try out different effects if you want. And anytime you try an effect and you don't want it, you simply click this little X right here and it goes away. So once you've um once you've set up Cam Twist the way you want and how you want the image to look, what you're gonna need to do is start ScreenFlow. When you start ScreenFlow, you're gonna have a couple of options. I can't show you the ScreenFlow box because I can't start ScreenFlow because I'm recording. But if you look here at at this screenshot that I've taken of the login window, when you log into ScreenFlow, you'll have two options from the drop down box built in eyesight and cam twist. Pick cam twist and you'll get the new window with all of your effects. Now, an important point is cam twist needs to be running before you start ScreenFlow. Otherwise, all that's going to show up is the eyesight, and you won't get the cool effects. So I hope that you can use this to help improve your ScreenFlow presentations. Um, I hope you like it. Bye-bye. <laughs>